What's going on lads, a 4 here and welcome back to another episode of Trading to an Inform in a day. Today we're going to be trading up to an Inform Bodmer guys. He's a centre back with 80 shooting on him which is actually insane so uh, yeah, I've chosen him to trade up to a today. We tra end up trading up to around about 12,000 coins. Start off here by picking up 7 sniper cards for 350 coins and below and we're going to li be listing them all up for 400 coins. Making some decent profit guys and it's just a different method to start off instead of sniping BPL silvers and Jack Wilshers. Um, although later on we do venture back into Jack Wilsh, as you can see they all sold in within about 10 minutes, it's a pretty easy method, and we end up sniping 6 more, which um, equals out to 13 sniper cars I do think, all together. When we come back, as you can see, 13 items were sold, 16 in the, um, the transfer list. Sorry this episode is a bit longer than normal, it's just because every time I get a new item I have to scroll through all of the sniper cards, that's why it's 4 minutes 30, but just bear with me and uh, drop a like on the video because some of these bears to snipe you can actually do as well and they actually work really well to snipe with. Pick up 3 BPL Spaniards, they ended up all being Monreal's, but um, I was looking for Jack, um, Arteta's too, and if we were extremely lucky, Santiago's orders, which I know is never going to pop up for 1.1k or under. Pick up our first Jack Wilshire of the episode. I don't think we're going to have a trading to an inform in a day without picking up a Jack Wilshire. Start off here by picking him up for 450 coins. Nearly as low as buying now, so that was absolutely fantastic. And sending him on for 1.8 thousand. When we come back, as promised, all of these Monreals have sold on, so uh, yeah. Making some good profit on them. Starting with second Jack Wilshire of the episode, this time for 1.5k. Sending him on for 2,000 coins, was it? I believe it was. Yes, it was, guys. And I'm making some decent coins on him. Of course, always look to snipe for 300 coins or lower. Wouldn't go to 200 unless I'm just trying to make this uh, nitty gritty profit. Me, I go 500 coins just because Jack Wilshire is such an easy player to snipe. And um, after sniping two of him, I just um, changed up the Arsenal player. Went to a Kieran Gibbs. This time bought him for 2.5k. Sending him on for 3,000 coins, making some. Some pretty good profit on him guys about 390 coins or so which is actually solid and um, that puts uh, that puts us up to a decent total when we come back of course Kieran Gibbs has actually sold on and uh, slowly filling up the transfer list guys with all these sniper cards we pick up another Jack Wilshire yes it is guys this time for 1.5k I think I believe I sent him on for 2,000 coins there we go so we are again making some good coins on him. And if you are enjoying the series, guys, be sure to drop it a like because um last episode we got seven likes. But if we could try and hit that again, that would be fantastic. Ten likes would be absolutely superb. We pick up another Jack Wilshire this time for 1.6k, listing up for 2.1k at uh, three outs, just to clarify the sale. Come back here, guys. 21 items have sold. And um, as you can see, that Jack Wilshire has sold on. And we picked up yet another one, this time for 1.4k. I believe we sell him on for 2,000 coins or even 2,100 coins. Have to wait and see about about this one yeah 2100 coins that's a really good deal very happy with that one making around about 540 coins on that one so that is very very good guys when we come back, as you can see here, through all of the sniper cars and the Wilshires, we have yet another Jack Wilshire. This time in Cam, and a really, really good deal for 1,000 coins. Ended up listing up for 2.1k in three hours, and uh, that, that actually went on and sold pretty quickly. I think because it was in Cam, as you can see here, 23 items have now sold. Another one is no Jack Wilshires. If you are enjoying this, be sure to comment down below um, any questions about who you should snipe with a certain amount of coins, and I will just let you know. Um, yeah, guys. So if you want any help with trading, then just comment down below, and I will definitely get that out for you guys. Um, come back here, nothing new has actually sold on after I listed up that Jack Wilshire, because um, five minutes later, I'd gone and sniped another one, as you can see here. He's still selling, he does eventually sell. But uh, yeah, we have picked up another one this time here for 1.1k. That's actually the final Jack Wilshire of the episode, I think, and that basically just rounds it up. Guys, 1.1k, selling off for 1.9k on a quick sale. When we come back, 25 items, 25 have sold. So uh, yeah, nearly filled up the whole transfer list with... um. Sniper cars and Jack Wilshire's, but we did mix up a bit, mainly sticking to Arsenal players because they're pretty good to snipe. Um, next episode, I'll try and switch up a bit. Imagine we do an episode without uh, with avoiding Jack Wilshire's, that'll be sick. But there we go, actually, guys. Sniped one for um, 9.7k, very easy there on Bodma. So that is obviously sick. And uh, that's basically going to wrap it up, guys. As I say, if you have any comments on trading, then leave them in the suggestions box down below. If you enjoyed it, smash the likes on the video because um, uh, this series has been going really well recently. That's going to be it. See you later. Bye.